Alright, first promo. Don't say Brock Day Howl, Brock Day Howl, Brock Day Howl Shot, Brock Day Howl Shot, and Brock Day Howl, Brock Day Howl, Brock Day Howl Shot, Brock Day Howl Shot, and Brock Day Howl, Brock Day Howl, Brock Day Howl Shot, 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 Brock Alright, we come again with another little, little hit on a return to the Lord. Alright, come back to your true power. Alright, this is your house by Shem Yahweh Shah, man. Alright, let me this hand, man. Alright, let me this hand, man. Alright, you got a country treasure camp. 
You know, hey, all this calamity, hey, it's coming. Mm. All right, sudden destruction is going to come upon you like what? The deep in the night. God, it said, for suddenly shall the wrath of the Lord come forth, and that security. You know, and that security, when you're feeling safe, you know, when you're thinking you're good, you know? Uh -huh. And my God. Yep, yep, yep. This is exactly, bro. When, when, like I said, in the days of the Lord, how it's going to be, yeah. when you have my shimmy out shot time, man. God. They know they, they party, you yep, know? Yep, yep, yep. Giving the marriage. Yeah. So when our people think that it's all good, and once Esau Aesop think it's all good, it's all good. God. Oh yeah. They say, uh, for some should the wrath of the Lord come forth. Uh, and that security that should be destroyed. Yeah. And that's it's like and, and perish in the day of vengeance. Right, and you're gonna perish, man. You're gonna die, man. It's yeah. you know? plain. Destroy. It's a uh um, uh that should know the devil by pain. You yeah, know? Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. God, I just yeah. the Chapter 9, starting at 10. Right. No, I'm starting at 9 now. Oh, yeah. It says, Then should I be in pitiful case, which now have abused my ways. See, I'm being pitiful case, man. Yep. Because what? You 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 love the law, man. Alright, you despise the prophets, man. But telling you what you have about Shemaph Shah said, according to Matthew 10 and 20. It's not us that's speaking. It's the Lord speaking within us, man. God. So you see us on the highways and the hedges, alright, bringing out the prophecy. All right, that's the Lord speaking, man. All right, because you got to think about it. Well, every generation or uh, every kingdom, all right, that were ever uh, brought up, the prophets came out and prophesied against it, and it was towed down, man. All right, the Spirit of the Lord, hey, bring that kingdom down. All right, so what you think going to happen this time, man? You got the prophets out there doing the same thing I always, man. God. It said on the second edge of 99, then should they be in pitiful case. Yeah. Which now have built my ways. Right, but the reason why they're being pitiful case because they have no uh way to say that I didn't know. Yeah, because I was gonna say too, uh, uh the book of John said they have no cloak for their sins. Huh. You know? Yeah. Cause you were warned by the prophets, man. You walk past the camps, you kept walking, you know. Oh, you was cool with one of the prophets. You know what I mean? You knew you knew a prophet that, you know, you well, you knew him, he he used to work with you. You know what I mean? You, you never required in it. You just knew it was something about them. Come on. Are you seen on YouTube just the title of it? Yeah. Like, you heard this word, man. Yep. They put it in the music on that black, you know, it's right. Um, yeah. Uh, uh, Chingy. Chingy. Um, fuck. Kendra Lamar. Yeah, that's you right, know? bro. They have no yep. cloth for your sin, man. Yeah. You know? That'll be a pitiful case. And they, they have cast them away despitefully. So they'll the torments, man. That's right. You know, it's their second death. You yeah, know? They're going to burn the torment, man. That's their second death. All right. Hey, they're going to burn the torment, man. Okay. He said, for such in that life have received benefits and have not known me. Right, right, right. And, and, and this going to the post shop pastors and, you know, the other people thinking that, all right, because they got a nice house, a nice car, you know what I mean? Uh -huh. That the Lord blessed them. You know, no, you just receive your consolation, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, Little favor is shown to the wicked. That's right. That still should not understand. You yeah. know, what's the paraphrase, yeah. man? Yeah. You know, think in the day in that security, man. You think you're living good, you know? Yeah, they got, they got it all figured out. You think you're you God, God with me. You know, God with me. I'm going to get right with him soon. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I, I don't know the judgment of the Lord. Yeah, how about Shemai Shah, man? Y'all think the look y'all think y'all can put the law on y'all time, man. Yeah. You know? That's right. It don't work like that, man. You know? It said uh, verse eleven, second answer nine eleven. And they that have blown my law, but they had yet liberty. Yep, see? Freedom to do so. Alright, liberty. Freedom to do so, man. Alright, you can go wherever you wanna go, do whatever you wanna do, man, at this time. But guess what? This time is coming to an end, man. God. They were saying, I'm repent, you know. Well, the king of heaven is at hand. No. Come back to the true power, y'all, why y'all shot, you know. Yeah. He said, and they that have known my law, while they had yet liberty, and was yet place of repentance was open Ooh. unto them. Well, not the door open. Yep. Do not you have my shot still got his hand stretched out still? God. You know? Well, as the, hey, well, like they say in the churches, like uh, the doors of repentance is open. You know what I'm saying? But guess what? Surely it's been closed, man. All right, and once the door closed, here y'all become beating on the door. But guess what? It's too late, man. 
because you have our Shema Shah, it's going to seal, seal that door up, man. Just like he sealed the, uh, the Ark of Noah, man. Uh, All right, same thing going to happen this time, man. Uh, I'm trying to find a quick piece of something. It said, when that place of repentance was open unto them. And that's that Proverbs, um, the first chapter. Yeah. You know? It said, uh, understood not, but despise it. You know? Yeah. Understood not. All right? But ultimately, it's going to give them to you, you know, to, to understand. But guess what? The Most High justified in all his works, man. Yep. Yeah. Uh, you know, they say y'all despise it, man, because y'all hate the word of the Lord. Y'all hate discipline, man. Yeah, y'all hate, hate, yeah, hate order and discipline, man. You get that uh, second Chronicles 15, 13? Huh. Uh, just the point, second Ezra 9 and 12. The same must know it after death by pain. Right. You know? That's how it's going to go down. No. That's how it's going to go down, man. Two thirds of our people. That's how it's going to go down, man. All right, you're going to know it after death by pain, man. Huh. All right? And those are the Dolan Nuclear Nuisance, man. The second deal, the Lake of Fire. Yeah. yeah. All right, this is 2 Chronicles 15 and 12. And they entered into the covenant to seek the Lord Yahweh power of their father. This is it. Okay, come. And with all their heart and with all their soul, that whosoever would not seek the Lord Yahweh power of Israel should be put to death. Whoever would not seek the Lord should be put to death, man. Yeah. Right from the soul, man. You know, you his people, man. You know, y'all show all of man. You ain't trying to come back to your true power, the true name, Jehovah Yahusha. You should be put to death, man. You know? Yep. And yeah, they, uh, uh, Caleb, they put on that Ecclesiastes 12 and 1. Come remember on, that, remember that the creator died you. Why did the evil days come? You know, and, and the years draw not when they shall have no pleasure in them, man. Right. Hey, because what? It's going to be a dog day, man. Yep. All right? It's gonna be a dog day for two thirds of our people, man. Come what it say, woe to you that desire the day of the Lord. And yeah. I most and I, man, it's, it's coming. Yeah. And it says verse 13, that whosoever will not seek the Lord Yahweh power of Israel should be put to death, whether small or great, whether man or woman. And the Lord is not respecting a person, man. You know what uh Ezekiel 9 and 4 say, man? You know? Yeah, I got that Isaiah. It's Isaiah. 55 and 6. Seek ye the Lord your house, while he may be found. Call ye upon him while he is near. Alright? And how is the Lord near? How can you find the Lord? Alright? On the highways in the head, you probably real quick. You probably want to go ahead and swim. Yeah. And this is how you're going to find Yah by Shemal Shah, man. Alright? Instead of going to the fucking Holy House, man. Uh, it said, Proverbs 120, wisdom cry way out. She utter her voice in the street. See, she utter her voice in the street, man. You know? All right, so where can you find the Lord at? On the highways and the hedges, man. Uh, All right? Go uh, ahead, uh. Keep going there. Yeah, yeah. It says, she cried in the chief place of concourse, in the openings of the gates. Right. In the city, she utter her words, saying, how long you simple ones would you love simplicity? And how long you simple ones would you love simplicity, man? All right? How long would you endure? They are slaves is uh, Israelites, man. God. All right? Two things about people don't know they are slaves, man. God. They just think this is life, man. But, hey, no, this is not life, man. Yup. They think uh, getting a nice car, a nice house. Just simplicity, man. Yeah, again, on buying all the new J's every fucking day. Get on playing 2Ks, just smoking every fucking day. They think that's life. They think that's living your best life, man. That's right. You know? The Lord, the hey, Lord gonna kill a lot of you niggas, man. That's right. You know? Ultimately, the Lord rejected the niggas, man. Yeah. You know, you read Jeremiah 6 and 30, you know? Yeah, because you gotta remember, you have our Shema Shah, not a respectful person, man. God. All right? Yeah, it's gonna get it. You gonna get it, man. Yup. You yeah. know? I'm gonna get this on wisdom. Go man. ahead, y'all. It said, uh, said, wisdom of Solomon is 7 to 27. And being but one, she can do all things. And remain in herself, she make it all things new. Right. And, and all ages entering into hope, holy, holy soul, souls. So like she making them friends of the Most High and prophets. Right. For the Most High love and love with him that does the wisdom. See, you know. But now that's how you gonna find you how about your mouth shot, man. Wisdom out of her voice out in the streets, man. Uh, all right. 
So when we go back to Proverbs 122, it said, How long be simple ones when you love simplicity right. and the scorners delight in the delight in that scorn and the fools hate knowledge. Yeah. You know? The fools hate knowledge, man. They refuse to come back and feel the true power. Yeah, you know? that's right. That's right. For he have torn and he will heal us. He has smited and he will bind us up. All right, after the after two days when he would reveal, reveal us, I mean revive us, and in the third day when he raised us up, and we shall live in his in his sight. All right, so guess what? Return unto your how about Shemaiah Shah, man. All right, so why he says, seek me, and you shall live. You know, seek the Lord and may be found, man. Yeah. Because the family of the world is coming, you know. Seek uh -huh. the, trying to seek the Lord, Hosea 5.15. Yeah, 5.15. Yeah. yeah. It says, Hosea 5.15. And I will go and return to my place that they acknowledge their offense and seek my face in their affliction. They will seek me early. They may affliction and they shall seek the Lord early, man. But he's not going to hear them, man. Yeah. You know? That's right. He's not going to hear their prayers, man. Uh -huh. You know? When all hell break out loose, they will trying to call on their power. If they know their name, even if they do know their name, they refuse and they still feel to come back. He ain't even gonna deal with them. Yeah, man. what he say? Uh there gonna be men in that day calling Lord Lord. Yep. You uh -huh. know, there gonna be men in that day, man. Uh get that uh Jeremiah real quick. Okay, turn on the yeah, angles. Alright, uh, this Jeremiah five and um uh, uh let me see. No, three, so like Jeremiah 3, and uh, I'm going to start at uh, 12, Jeremiah 3 and 12. Go and claim these words toward the north and say, Return, thou backslide Israel, said the Lord. And I would not cause my anger to fall upon you, for I am merciful, said the Lord, and I would not keep anger forever. Right. You know? He said, I am merciful, man, because the hand still stretched out uh, still, you yeah. know? That's right. It would say, repent because the kingdom of heaven is hand, you know? It said, only acknowledge thy iniquity that they had transgressed against the Lord that power and has scattered their ways to the strangers on every green tree, and ye have not obeyed my voice, said the Lord. Right. Turn old backsliding children, said the Lord, for I am married unto you. That's right, man. All right. Hey, hey, the Lord I married unto us, man. Uh -huh. He likened Israel to a tender and delicate woman, man. All right. So we must. But you know the elect gonna return all right, back to like you know to the high by shot, you know what I'm saying? God. The elect gonna return, man. God. What did it say um this with the apple of his eye? God. You know, the so-called blacks, Hispanics, Latinos, and Indian, you know, the yeah. true biblical Israelites. You know, it said, Turn on best line cheers and said to the Lord, for I am made unto you, and I will take you one of the city, two of a family. And I will bring you to Zion. That's right. You know? Yeah, you got to remember us, man. God. Monument. All right? God. Yeah. Jump down 22. It said, We're telling you backsliding children, and I will heal your backslides. Behold, we come unto thee, for that are the Lord. Read that much. again now. Uh, okay, come. Jump down 22. It said, We're telling you backsliding children, and I will heal your backslides. And he will heal, man. All right? Hey, when you turn back to your true power, he's going to heal you, man. All right, when what does this say in the world, uh, uh, you know, like the truth will set you free? Yeah. All right, that, that's healing, man. Because now you know why you're in this position, man. Yeah. All right, now you know why why uh, Israelite, I mean, the so called Negro, Latino, Native American, do the things that they do, man. Yeah. All right, it's a healing process when you come back to the laws that you command with the Lord. All right? That's why I say uh, in Genesis, he breathed in their nostrils the breath of life because what? You start living again, man. Okay. All right? Without this knowledge, you dead, man. You been walking something. So that's why he said, return back, but he can heal you, man. Okay. That's the Bible's life. You know? Yep. Like, um, and I will hear your best lines. Behold, we come unto thee, for thou art the Lord, Yahweh, our power. That's right, man. Because the Lord, I married unto us, man. All right. Uh, get the Amos. Okay, come. It's Amos five and four. For thus said the Lord Yahweh unto the house of Israel, Seek ye me, and ye shall live, man. All right, because you know by seeking the Lord, the brother put up the precept 
Ecclesiastes uh, 12 and 13. And that's going to conclude the whole matter. All right? Bring your how about you, my shine. Keep his commandments, man. That's the whole duty of man. All right? And once you, did, when, once you do that, guess what? You start to live again, man. All right? Because what? You're rehearsing the righteous acts, man. And when you're rehearsing, you what you're practicing, practice what? Make perfect, man. All right? And that's what we're trying to do. We're trying to be perfect, man. In the eyes of your high about your mouth shot, man. All right? Now this is the book of Luke 14 and 23. Oh. And the Lord said unto the servant, go out into the highways and hedges. Right. right? And compare them to come in. Right. And to compare them to come in, man. All right? Do we not persuade men through the terror of the Lord? All right, because that's what we're doing. We persuade men through the terror of the Lord because we know all right, what Yahweh Bashima is about, man. He's a terrible demon like power, man. God. All right, and he don't play no games, man. God. All right, our people really think the Lord is, is, is some some joke or something, man. All right, our people really think Yahweh Bashima is something that you can just stand on the stool and pick him up whenever you want to, man. The Lord don't get down like that, man. God. Do not the power, do not the power have power on the clay, man. All right? Uh, and since you said, I'm glad this week. Go ahead, y'all. Jeremiah 8 and 7. Yeah, the stork, the stork in the heaven know of uh, point of times. Uh, and the turtle and the crane and the swallow observe the time of their coming. Right. But my people know not the judgment of the Lord. See? That, that, that's, that's plain, man. But the Negro, Latino, Native American do not know the judgment of the Lord, man. Yep. That's why we out there, man. That's why the prophets had the prophets had to go out there week in, week out. To let the people know the judgment of the Lord, man. Because it ain't in them, man. Yep. Alright? We 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 just from our heritage, man. It's, it's not in check, man. Yep. Alright? But the Lord put the spirit on certain means to go out there and, and, and prophesy, man, and warn the people. Uh, Isaiah 1 3, the ox knows his owner and the ass is master crib. And look how he look how he putting two stubborn animals to, to represent Israel, man. Alright, two stupid animals, man. Yep. He said the ox knows his owner and the ass is master crib. And they know. After all that stubborn shit they do, they still know, man. Yep. Uh, he said, but Israel do not know, my people do not consider. And, and, and that, that's fine. You see that, man. You see that when you be on the highway in the head. Jake walked right past like we. We don't even exist, man. Yeah. But they don't even consider. They don't even say, hey, what y'all got here for? Yeah. Why y'all got on them, you know, repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand, man. God. And our salvation and everything we believe, man. Come back to your true power. Yeah. That's all you have to do. Come back. And he'll come back up to you, man. That's you right. Know. Yeah. You know. That's right, bro. Uh, to come in that my house might be filled. Yep, and it's gonna be filled with 144,000 men and one third of the nation of Israel, man. Uh, All right? It's gonna be filled just like that. You know? It says, um, verse 24, for I say unto you, that none of those men which were bid should taste of my supper, man. That's right. You know, it said bid to call. That means to invite, you know? Yeah. That's what we all the highways and angels are doing, you know? Come back to your true power before it's too late, before all the evil days come. Come there, you know. That's right. For my slaughter hit, you know. Yeah, because once, 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 hey, once the Lord bring the terror, it's over, man. It's over. You know, this is anger, you know, this is vengeance, you know. Yeah. So, um, let us switch on what we did too. This is Ezekiel 7, starting at 5. Oh. Thus said the Lord, you have I shall shout power and evil, and <coughs> only evil, behold, is come. Yeah. Evil means hard times, man. You know. All right. A dreadful day. Take the trouble. But says, an end is come, the end is come, a watcher for thee, behold, it is come. Yeah. The morning is come unto thee, oh, that does in the land, the time is come, and the day of trouble is near. See? That's why we say, day of trouble. And at the sound again of the mouse, now will I surely pour out my fury upon thee, Ooh. and accomplish my anger upon thee, and I will judge thee according to thy ways, Man. and will recompense thee for all thy abominations. And my eyes shall not spill, neither will I have pity. I know they ain't reading that at church. <laughs> no, I ain't reading this at church, man. They ain't reading that at church, man. The people have to start thinking like, what is the Lord's spirit? What is the Lord's anger? And you seen what Esau did to us. I right, but look, this is how you know the Lord's anger. 
You look at, you ever have uh, watched the lions fight, the animals fight? Hey, the Lord is terrible, man. You see how them, how them be mauling each other? You see how Jake just be fighting each other? And, he, he, and the Lord said his anger, his anger a thousand times, you know what I'm saying? Just, Amen. no, man, come on, man. It said, in my eyes should not spill, neither will I have pity, man. You know? Ooh. Lord will begin down that day. What's it um slam the Lord should be, be men. Yep, because mm -hmm. you gotta remember, Esau didn't have no pity. Alright, you and we just we got some you know certain certain documents of how Esau did, you know, nigga all Latino Native Americans. Alright? But what the Lord gonna do, because the Lord has put the spirit on Esau to do us like that, man. But when the Lord put his mind, it's, it's, it's unexplainable, man. That's why I say it's going to be a time like never before, man. Yeah, All yeah. right? Because it's, un it's unexplainable, man, what's going what's to go down, man. Hey, this is Ezekiel 9 4, man. You know, we want that mark of the why. You know, yep. it's up for judgment, man. That's right. Because if not, your ass is grass, man. You have about some more shot along, bro. <laughs> They say, in my eyes should not spill, neither will I have pity, I will recompense thee according to thy ways, and thy abomination that are in the midst of thee. That's right. And ye should know that I am the Lord. Oh, hey, the Lord did this, man. The Lord did this, man. You know, the Lord, hey, the Lord doing this, man. This is moving. He created, he spoke everything to existence, man. It's just playing out, man. God. You know? There's anything else about um, yeah, That's it. All uh, right, hey, hey, so with that, man, once again, I'm going to edify. We give all honor and glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh, Shah, Ba'ashem, Ka'ak, Kudash, number one to our elders, a piece of blessing, I hope you'll let Till next time, brother, Shalom, Shalom, Abba, 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 Ab